champions, you're desperately trying to get more power on your serve, your first serve, but you're just not getting enough power. And you see these guys, they don't have a lot of muscle, small guys, but for, for some reason they're getting more power than you, even though you're stronger. I'm gonna help you today and I'm gonna give you some tips and reasons why you're not getting the power that you should. You could use some of these principles on your second serve as well. first one is guys I have to talk about it is the grip you are still too Eastern with your grip which means everything is stiff let me show you quickly if I grab a ball yeah everything is stiff I see a lot of beginner players intermediate players go like this and then it's all muscle what you don't realize is the more muscle you try and use the less less power you're gonna get okay now it's not enough for me to say just relax because you can't relax this grip. You have to go very sharp grip, continental, or even a little bit more. What happens then is your wrist is able to loosen up. A good idea is also, before you serve, you can watch a lot of pros. They do this, they do this. What is the reason for this? The more loose your wrist is, the more you're gonna be able to swing through that ball without forcing, okay? So now I'm gonna relax my wrist and show you what happens. There. Not even trying and it's just going. So that's the first tip guys. Do not force. Find a way to relax your wrist. What you'll notice is the more you relax, the more power you get. Please understand that tennis is not about how much muscle you can use, but how loose you can be and have your timing right. The next one is I cannot, I cannot not talk about this. I have mentioned this on a previous video. Camera, just go next to me. You're not doing a trophy position. What is a trophy position? The trophy position comes from, I'm sure you've seen a lot of trophies actually that you can buy with the little tennis guy on there. And most trophy positions look like this, most trophies. And that is the position you want, okay? Again, a lot of players, they don't get power because they're in this position. So there's no upwards movement, Shoulder, the elbow is too high. As soon as you go left arm up, it drops the shoulder and you have this line. Notice another thing that happens now is your back leg has to lift, which brings me to, which has to bend, which brings me to my next point. If you're not gonna use the strongest part of your body, which is your legs, you're not gonna have enough power, okay? Another benefit of the trophy position, you're gonna get power this way. As you go up, you get power this way. It's gonna give you a lot more power. And from here, you can also release this way okay so trophy and legs plus the relaxed motion so once again guys trophy it drops into the, sh the, the elbow that drops into the shoulder and then drops into the back leg and then you can accelerate notice how my, my wrist is still loose Jeez, I'm serving well today for some reason. Now, one more tip I'm gonna give you guys is uh, once, you, once you've set up properly, it's so important for you to jump up and forward and stay up. Too many players, they do everything correctly and then they go, they go down. You're losing so, so much power by doing that. As I've mentioned before in a, another video, you wanna feel like you're floating up in the air Loose rest, trophy, legs, and then stay up, okay? What that's doing is it's allowing, it's allowing all the power that you generated to release into the racket on top. But if you come down with the body, you're losing all the power you generated. Let it all go into the racket first and then relax. So yeah. Staying up. Trophy. Okay, another one. All right, guys, I'm gonna leave you with that for now. If I had to choose one of those tips that's the most important for now, that's helped me the most, is loosening up the arm and the wrist. It's gonna help you with your timing, it's gonna be effortless, and you're gonna feel like you're not forcing anymore. This is why small, little players are able to generate power, because they're not using strength, they're just relying on the timing with the right principles. Hope that helps you guys. I hope you get more power on your serve. 
Please do not forget to like this video, subscribe, share with a friend. See you next time.